And a lot of people ask us, well, what, isn't it safe? Isn't it, good Lord. Well, hey friends and neighbors, this is Chuck out at Sheraton Park Farms. Welcome back to the farm. So one thing we've not spent a whole lot of time talking about are our eggs. And we sell a whole lot of eggs right here off the farm. And we also sell a whole lot of eggs at the farmer's markets. And folks are always real surprised whenever we tell them that their eggs are gonna be okay sitting out on the counter for, <laughs> he's a very loud chicken. Folks are always surprised when we tell them that their eggs are gonna be fine sitting out, sitting out on the counter for a couple of weeks. So let's talk a little bit about how we manage our chickens in our egg mobile and how we keep our eggs clean. Hang around. So one of the primary ways that we make sure that we've got clean eggs is we make sure that our chickens stay healthy. And we do that through rotation. We keep our chickens in this poultry netting from Premier One. Uh, we don't energize it. We elect not to do that because the chickens just, they seem to stay in it pretty good. And so far, knock on wood, we've not had a lot of predator issues uh, with our egg laying chickens. But we keep them inside a 300 foot circle uh, where the egg mobile is. And then we move these guys around about once a week. We move them onto a new spot. Uh, they moved here onto this spot yesterday, uh, already starting to get some bare spots where they scratch and dig and kind of create some dust baths, but that's fine. Um, they do put down a lot of manure. They stir up the soil a little bit and it's really good for the grass. So moving our chickens, that's the first thing that we do to make sure that we've got clean, healthy eggs. So the next thing that we do to make sure that our eggs stay clean is we make sure that the nest boxes stay clean. We use these nesting pads. We buy these from Duncan's Poultry and I'll post a link to them in the, in the description down below. And I think you can get them on Amazon, can't you? You can also get them on Amazon. I'll post a link to those down below as well. These are just a, it's a, it's a, it's a fibrous material that's glued onto the back of a, of a piece of paper backing. These work really, really good because you can either just toss them right on top of the, uh, the existing pad that's in there, or you can pull them out and throw them away. We choose to just cover them up. So here's a nesting pad. I mean, everything is pretty much chewed up. It's pretty much gone in there. So we just put a new nesting pad right in there and that keeps the nesting areas clean. At night, whenever we come down and get the eggs, again, this is, this is a fresh egg right out of the box. I've not cleaned it, washed it. I just walked down here and got it. And you can see both those eggs are just, they're pristine clean. There's just, there's no chicken poo at all on them. So making sure that your nesting boxes and your nesting area stays clean is also a big contributing factor to make sure that you've got good clean eggs. Got a couple of broody chickens, a couple of broody hens in here. This one here, no, this one here, she's a real, <laughs> yeah, she's a real fussy one. So, and again, you know, here, we've not touched these eggs. These are just, as we find them, I mean, these eggs are just, they're just clean eggs. Do have a, a nest there. We need a new pad in it. Got one here, need a new pad in it. So it makes, just makes a huge difference to, uh, keep, there's an egg, got a little bit of poo on it, but, uh, you know, it makes a huge difference just to keep those next nest boxes clean. So a big factor in making sure that your nest boxes and your nesting areas stay clean is closing up your nest, closing up the nest boxes. So every night when we come out to do evening chores, we collect eggs and we step up in here and we close up our roosting bars so that the chickens can't sleep in the nest boxes. Chickens have a strong tendency to poo where they sleep. So we found that by preventing them, uh, of get, preventing them from getting up in the nest boxes and sleeping there, we don't get the nesting pads nearly as dirty. They last a whole lot longer. And every day those eggs, with just a few exceptions on rare occasions, those eggs are pristine clean every single time. So closing up the nest boxes at night, that's another good way to make sure that your eggs stay clean. So a lot of people ask us, well, isn't it unsafe to leave eggs out on the counter? They're supposed to be refrigerated. In a lot of other countries, they don't refrigerate their eggs because they don't wash them. And the reason they wash eggs is because they're covered in chicken poo. And when a chicken lays an egg, she puts a mucus coating on that egg called the bloom. And that bloom seals up the porous surface of that shell. And when that porous surface is sealed up, it prevents bacteria from getting out and it prevents the contents of the egg from evaporating out. So the egg stays fresh. 
when you wash an egg, you wash that bloom off and it allows bacteria to get through that shell into the contents of the egg. So if you leave the, the bloom intact, the egg has a natural protective coating on it. A lot of eggs that you buy in the store come from factory egg, egg farms. And basically those chickens live all day and all night in a two foot by two foot by two foot box. They eat, they sleep, they lay eggs, and they poo in that box. And so there's a natural problem with those eggs being just nasty. Whenever those eggs are put through the washers, um, the water that those things are washed in, is it's got chlorine, it's got bleach, it's got all kinds of chemicals, and it's also got residual chicken poo from other eggs that are cross-contaminating each and every single egg that goes through that, that wash line. So again, we believe that just leaving those eggs natural, intact, without washing the bloom off, they're safer, they're cleaner, they're much healthier, and they last longer. We tell folks your eggs are gonna be fine out on your counter for you know, a couple, three weeks, or if you wanna put them in the refrigerator, they're gonna be fine in the refrigerator probably for six, seven, maybe even eight weeks. A lot of eggs you buy in the store, they're at least 30 days old anyway. So fresh eggs, keeping them clean, makes all the difference in the world. Here's how in the chicken world you get extras in your movie. See? So that's how we manage our, our eggs and our, uh, and our laying flock uh, here at the farm. We love chickens. You know, these guys are just a lot of fun to, uh, they're a lot of fun to watch. They're a lot of fun to care for. And they give us, you know, a lot of eggs in, in return. So, you know, chickens are great animals. We really enjoy them. Super easy to keep your eggs clean. Super easy to have good, healthy, quality food. Just by taking a few simple steps of keeping your nest boxes clean, keep your chickens moving, and don't let them be sleeping in there. Don't let them be sleeping where they're laying their eggs. So listen, we appreciate y'all watching. I'm gonna post a couple of links to some videos right over here, some other stuff we got going on. If you've not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Uh, we got a lot of new folks that are uh, joining us and following along. Leave us a comment down below. Let us know where you're from. We've talked to folks all over the country and uh, we really enjoy hearing where folks are at and where they're seeing us at and, uh, and what's going on in your world. So appreciate y'all watching. We'll see you on the next video. Thanks. Crazy chickens. <laughs>